Right, quick video. <sighs> quick video, I'm going I'm still on the coastal footpath. I've just left Dunster Beach, heading for the blue anchor. <clears throat> Every now and again you might possibly hear a <sighs> choo choo puffer. God, I can bet your life. Every time I turn this video on somebody comes along. Just gonna turn it off for now. Ah, oh, there's a train. That's the steam train. I went on the locomotive a minute ago. Don't know if I'll see it again. Hold on. Just missed it. Don't know if you can hear it. Ch -ch 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 -ch. Look at that pebbly type pillar box in the middle of a field there. Someone else coming now. Beautiful countryside though. There's the castle that Zoom in. Dunster Castle, which I need to go to as well. Haven't been there for years, 30 years. Yeah, it's about 30 years since I've been there. Beautiful, isn't it? Back on again. So I said, it's not even, it feels like a weekend, there's so many people about. I'm um, risking a part of the coastal path where there's lots of people. I still managed to um, get by though right there and chatted a few people outside their little beach huts. <laughs> Look really nice and cosy. Their tables and chairs and their cups of tea. And there even a little bit of washing on the line beautiful and they can look right out to the sea there. I've taken pictures of all the little huts. You know, some of them, not, not up, you know, a general picture. But the railway line is just running on the other side of this field. But every time I try to home in on one, trees and things get in the way and now we've got somebody with scooters coming along now um no those electric those electric scooter things you know them not scooters buggies that older people with disabilities use then there's about a group of six people coming along 
what I'm going to do is just join up all these join up all these um, videos together just have a little look at the beach while we're here I think I haven't really bothered yeah so up there is Dunster Beach back there of course I've walked right the way round from Minehead after getting off the train I'll get back on the path I think over and out right I've had all sorts of problems with the camera it wouldn't charge up for ages kept saying weird things like connecting to USB I haven't seen that before and a sub and a funny symbol but this is the blue anchor now see you can't go on the beach now look apparently you can walk around this bit up here there's apparently there is a path I thought I'd just video a bit. I haven't been able to video for ages. In fact, I haven't been able to video hardly at all. I've hardly been able to video at all. I could have got on that, bit, that bus. I don't want to. I want to do the walk. It's starting to change the weather now though. Yes, I'm, I'm glad I've got all these clothes on, tell the truth. Then I've got a windshield if it got nippier. I'm just hoping I'm going to pick up this track that they go on about. They said, oh you just got the road. It looks bloody dangerous to me. So I've walked right the way round, right the way round to Minehead, past Dunster Beach. This is the Blue Anchor, which normally when the tide's not in, you can walk round. But you can be cut off by the side. I've just got to try and find a sign now. The sign's disappeared for the coastal walk, to be quite honest. I've now got to go on this bloody road. They said it's only a little road. Very quiet, they say. I think I can see a pole though. Christ, that's how I'm going to get walk along this. I hope there's a path. I hope there's a path. There is a sign though. Looks like there might be a bit of a path. It's a nice old house, isn't it? With shuttered windows. It's obviously dangerous here with lots of um, erosion. I'm just going to go right over there where you see some quite pointy things. That's Butlins. I walked right past there earlier and took photos. I missed the steam train. Missed the steam train. Right now, fortunately, there is a sign. Thank God for that. Right, turning off.